Let's take a live look at the White House right now. For the second time this week, the Biden administration announcing it's wiping out more student loans. More than a quarter of a million borrowers will get an email from the White House today telling them their debt has been canceled. This is totaling $7.5 billion. Rebecca Castor has more. Thanks to what we're doing, that student debt is no longer holding you back. President Joe Biden smashing his own record, canceling more student loan debt than any other president. With his latest announcement Friday, wiping out an additional $7.4 billion for some 277,000 borrowers, bringing his total to a whopping $153 billion in student loan forgiveness. My administration is taking the most significant action to provide student debt relief ever in the history of this country. The Supreme Court shot down Biden's original, more sweeping student loan forgiveness plan last year, but that's not stopping him from finding other ways to cancel debt. The White House says it's using existing programs such as SAVE, a plan for low-income borrowers launched last year. But the payoffs have been largely criticized by Republicans, and several states are suing to block said programs. The department's student loan forgiveness policies are unfair to Americans who did not go to college or that paid back their loans. I don't see it as um, unfair. I see it as we're fixing something that's broken. Many see the payouts as Biden trying to win back Gen Z. As a recent Fox News poll shows more young voters support Donald Trump over Joe Biden. The student loan forgiveness, these things that they are just handing out are not going to buy them the votes that they need. Uh, it's very clear that it's getting desperate. Donald Trump and House Speaker Mike Johnson will meet tomorrow in Florida and make an announcement on election integrity. But a path forward for FISA in Section 702 is likely to come up. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox 32 Chicago.